Hi guys, so this is my program for my PIC 16F877A for my serial interfacing communication. So in my program, I define my uh, configuration bits as shown in here. So I have using my include as xc.h file. And I'm using the frequency of 20 megahertz. I also define my baud rate as six, uh, 9600, sorry. Which is, this uh, This baud rate is commonly used in our world now. And I, for my first function, I'm naming initialize UART, which this all uh, is for my initialization of my UART. So, I am initialize my twice uh, C ports RC6 as equal to 0. So, I set my port C RC6 set as output. And I set my twice SC7, which is port C RC7, as my input, which is 1. For my SPBRG, I'm using the formula of the F clock divided by 16, which this um, result will be divided by birth rate and then minus 1. So uh, I'm using a high speed of BRGH, which is defined as high speed uh, of birth rate. And I'm using a synchronous mode, so SYNC equal to 0. And I'm using serial port for RC6 and RC7, um, which is span is a definition of um, enable of TX and RX. I'm also enable the TXEN, which is the transmit enable. I'm also enable CREN, which is the um, for continuous receive bit. For my TX9 and RX9, I'm set as zero as I'm using a bit transmission and reception. For my second function, I'm using UART CENTAR, um, naming as UART CENTAR, and the condition is TAR BT, which BT is initialized as character. So, uh, I'm hold the program QTX buffer is free, which can be seen here. And I'm assigned the TXREG as BT, which is assigned to here. So later I will be getting to it in the main function. So the third function is naming as UartGetTar, which uh, inside the function I'm coding uh, if the O is uh, occur overrun arrow, which is clear by CREN. Then the CRN will be um, reset and continue to receive data for this tool. Then I also uh, hold the program till the uh, RX buffer is free and return the RC RAG, which is uh, return and receive the value of the, to the main function. Then the fourth function is UR censoring. Which condition is char star xt uh, pt? So this is if there is a char, then it will process it as a byte data, which is one byte is equal to eight bits. So now the fifth function is my main function. I have initialized my get value as integer. I also initialized try speed. Uh, is my output, which is the port B, lah. is all as output. I call the function initialize UART, which is uh, stating from the first function. Then I wow the loop, wow this uh, all the function, and always it will always loop bring this function, this coding here. So I'm sending a display of uh, by using UART censoring, which is 
from the fourth function, stating that you are module initialized and active, and type 1 to on and type 0 to off. As you can wondering why there is a backslash r and backslash n, this is for the function of uh, return the cursor and to, to move to the next line. And then um, I'm assigned UART get char function to my get value, which is integer, initialized as integer. So if my get value equal to 1, then RB3 will be 1, which is it will be turned on the LED. Then the UART centering, it will be displayed as RED uh, LED as on. This here function is for my limited character uh, from this string. Then if get value is equal to 0, then my RB3 uh, will be 0, which is it will be turned off the LED. Then the, sense, the, dis, the virtual terminal will be displayed as RED let equal to off and then limit it again. So this is my coding for my serial interfacing communication. So this is my circuit about serial interfacing, which virtual terminal will be communicate with the LED which emitted red light. So I'm using PIC 16F877A and for the internal oscillator, I'm using 20 megahertz, which is same from my program. And I'm connecting an external oscillator from here. There is a 5 volt power in series mode with resistor 1k ohm connected to the VPP of the PIC. So as you can see here, the connection, which is from RB3, to the LED is my output. I'm connecting a series R1, which is 470 ohm register to the LED. So the register function is to control the brightness of the LED. Now I'm going to run my simulation. As you can see here, my simulation is the virtual terminal, which is from here, can be shown. So when I type 1, the LED will be on. When I type 0, the LED will be off. So now I'm going to type 0 and see the result. So as you can see, when I type 0, it will show that the LED LED will be off. Thus, the LED will be off. If I type 1, the red LED will be on, as you can see here, the result. So back to my schematic diagram. So I have added a RS-232 uh, to USB converter. So this is more likely to be PIC communicate with a PC. Yeah, and the birth rate and the COM port must be same for each other to work. For example, in my program, I state my microcontroller um, word rate as 9600. So my uh, port here must be 9600 uh, for physical. Uh. So now, and I'm added for my RC6 is connected to my uh, max 232, T1 in and T1 out to the RXD of my RS-232 pins, pin 2. So this pin 2 is meaning as receive data. While the RC7 is connected from uh, the R1 in and out from the R1 out and connected to the third pin of my RS-232 
con uh, pins configuration. So this pin tree is definition as transmit data. So as you can see, the when the PIC transmit data, it will from RC six and the the PIC will be received by pin two. And RC seven, if if the microcontroller is um receiving data, is from the transmitted data from the uh RS uh, from the PC, which is from pin three. So now you clear on this uh circuit. Now I'm going to run my simulation. Okay, so now as you can see here, I have my virtual terminal, which is this, connected to here, to um, use as my PIC communication to my computer. So for now, I'm tapping 1, which is, I will tapping from my PC, communicate with my PIC. So if I type 1, then the LED will uh, on, right? If I type 0, uh, the LED will be off. Let's stay here. So if I type 0, the LED will be off. And it is from the PC, communicate to the PIC. If I type 1, then the LED will be turned on again. As you can see, when I type 0 or 1, here will be on uh, for like, 1.042 milliseconds so it will be very quick as you can see it will on and off on and off on and off on and off so it's meaning that the PIC uh, is uh, the, the PC is transmitting data to the PIC so this is all how it works Thank you. Thanks for watching. Bye.